Hello all you people, Curbs Dumber back here with another video and I am here, hold on one second, I got a, okay, it looked kind of blurry. Um, here with a Fast Lane 2016 review, decent pay-per-view, nothing too bad, I guess, it was okay. Um, it wasn't, you know, it's just, we're almost, we're heading up to WrestleMania. That pay-per-view is out of the way and gone. I wouldn't say it's bad, it was a little boring. Um, the match was, the match card was pretty predictable, but regardless, decent paper, um, decent pay-per-view, the pre-show was Kalisto versus Del Rio, um, two out of three falls for the U.S. title, um, Kalisto won with a roll-up, and yeah, nothing really too much happened in the match. Uh, moving on to our next match, the Divas Tag Team match between Sasha and Becky versus Tamina and Naomi. Um... Sasha and Becky won. Nothing really to it. I don't really have much to say about the match. It was fair. It was good. Kevin Owens versus Dolph Ziggler. That was a pretty good match. Kevin Owens had the victory. And yeah. Just nothing. Nothing. No, I'm not saying the matches are bad. But you know. It was a good match. No like really great spots in, like, in between the match. But whatever. Um, the six man tag team. Ryback, Kane, and Big Show versus the Wyatts. Ryback, Kane, and Big Show actually won. I wasn't expecting that. They're they're building the Wyatts up to be this really dominant faction, and they were really starting to get serious with the Wyatts. But I guess it all fell out. And um, it was a championship match: Charlotte versus um, Brie. Um, Charlotte won, of course, because they're trying to set up this triple threat: Becky, Sasha, and Charlotte, WrestleMania. Hopefully Bailey is able to like come up to the main roster soon before WrestleMania. Um, I don't know if she has a Divas um that I don't know if she has a um a match at um NXT Dallas Takeover for um the uh, NXT Women's Title. She could drop the title there, then debut the next night on WrestleMania Fatal Four Way for Horsewoman for the Divas Title. I would say Sasha should win that match just because she, it's Sasha Banks. I'm sorry, but you know. She'll have um, feuds in the future with probably Bailey or Becky or Charlotte or anybody on the Divas roster. And then, um, is that all the matches, I think, pretty much so far? And then we had the main event, the triple threat match between Roman, Ambrose, and Brock. This was a short match, but um, it was whatever. Um, Ambrose and Roman put Brock through two announce tables. Um, Brock hit a German suplex on Roman Reigns while he was holding Dean Ambrose on his shoulders. That was pretty cool. And then it all ended when Ambrose got in the ring. Well, hold on, let me go back a little bit. Brock had the Kimura lock on Ambrose. Had it locked in. And then Roman... Wait, did I say on Ambrose? No. Brock had the Kimura lock locked in on Reigns. And Reigns was get, picking up Brock to his... Like, he was... Like, Brock was, like, hanging on. The Roman, because he had, still had the Kamora lock locked in, and he was getting up. Then Ambrose comes in with a chair, starts hitting Brock, hits Brock on the back a lot more, turns to Roman, hits Roman on, on the back with, a, with the chair, goes back to Brock, hits him with the chair more, turns around, spear, one, two, three. Roman is your winner. If you did watch the pay-per-view, let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you're watching my review to see the results, let me know what you thought in the comment section down below. Hope you all like to subscribe. Catch you in the next video. The next pay per view is WrestleMania. So, yeah. See you guys.